Well, hours from now, the man accused of causing that crash that severely hurt a volleyball player from Tennessee is scheduled to appear in court. 21-year-old Daniel Riley faces multiple charges. Our Alex Fees is live for us this morning outside the Carnahan Courthouse with the very latest. Alex? Good morning, Michelle. Good morning. Daniel Riley is scheduled to appear in court today for a detention hearing. Now, Riley is charged in connection to what happened last weekend with second degree assault, armed criminal action, and several misdemeanors. At the time of the crash, Riley was on house arrest for an armed robbery charge. 17 year old volleyball player Janae Edmondson, who was in town with her family for a tournament, was struck in the crash and had to have her legs amputated as a result. Court records show Riley violated the terms of his GPS monitoring dozens of times. This morning, St. Louis City Circuit Attorney Kim Gardner faces more fallout. She is declining interviews with local media, but she appeared on an internet show defending herself. And we will have Gardner's comments coming up in our 6.30 half hour. In the meantime, Dan Riley's court appearance today is scheduled for noon. Live this morning downtown, Alex Fees, 5 on your side.